forget about it when you're in Italy to get fined or even arrested. 10,000 euros is considered an aggravated crime, an arrest of up to six months. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will tell you how to keep yourself out of trouble while exploring Italy, because there are a few things that tourists might not know. So if you want to learn what you can or can't do while in Italy and how to avoid getting fined for seemingly harmless actions, don't forget to subscribe first and then we can begin. As the vacation season approaches, many tourists choose the Italian coast for their holiday. However, there are a few things that you should never do if you don't want to get fined or even arrested. Have you ever taken a cute little seashell as a souvenir to bring back from your vacation? Well, forget about it when you're in Italy. It is actually prohibited to take any seashells or other natural materials from the sea. And if you get caught, you might expect a fine of up to 10,000 euros. Did you know that taking sand from the beach is considered an aggravated crime? Just don't try to steal any sand to build your home. As someone did some time ago here and got into a lot of trouble and made the news. If you guys want to learn even more about Italy, for example, like how to save money on your next vacation, or where to go, which hotel to choose and which itinerary to create, check out my Patreon page through the link in the description. I post weekly advice and tips, my secret spots, the best itineraries for you to customize, and much, much more, as well as bi-monthly expert life advice. Not only you will get tons and tons of useful information, but you will also greatly support my channel by subscribing. It might seem obvious, but I will warn you anyway. Fishing is not allowed unless you get a special permit. And even then, you will have tons of other regulations imposed on you. As for example, the type of fish you're allowed to catch, or the age of fish you're allowed to catch or not, and so on and so on. Last but not least, when it comes to the seaside, if you go to a public beach and want to leave your belongings, say overnight, like a sun umbrella, for example, not only you're risking a fine of up to 500 euros, but also an arrest of up to six months. Can you just imagine? You are not allowed to do so because it is considered the occupation of the public grounds. Camping in the non-dedicated areas is prohibited as well for the same reason. Moving inland, you are not allowed to pick up any natural material there as well. For example, you are not allowed to pick up any herbs or wildflowers and, of course, it is absolutely prohibited to pick up any mushrooms. Although, personally, I wouldn't do it anyway unless you have an expert with you because it can be really, really dangerous. But if you really, really, really want to go mushroom picking, good news for you! In most cases, you will be able to purchase a special pass that will allow you to go and pick up some mushrooms for one day or even longer. Each region has its own regulations, however, so in most cases you will have some restrictions and rules on which kind of mushrooms you are allowed to pick up and uh, how often and in which quantities, so pay attention to this and check in with your regional rules. Also keep in mind that most regions, provinces and even towns will have their own set of regulations and it can be incredibly confusing, especially for a foreigner to navigate this. So what you can do in Tuscany, for example, you won't be able to do in Piemont. And in some places you will have to pay for the pass, while in other regions all you have to do is register. So yes, I know the bureaucracy is savage in Italy, I say it all the times, and this is one of these cases. Another thing that is strictly forbidden here in Italy is to pick up any things from the archaeological sites. So when you're visiting Pompeii, for example, Please resist the temptation to take home any stone or any other kind of a remain. Just leave it there. You will get into a lot of trouble for taking this. You can get fined or even arrested if you pick up anything from any archaeological site around Italy. My best tip for you guys, when you're on holiday in Italy, enjoy this wonderful country, enjoy its beautiful nature but leave all the things where they belong. Don't pick up anything if you don't want to get in trouble and just leave all the things. Enjoy the beauty around you, but be respectful, be mindful of it. You know, there are tons of cute souvenirs that you can buy and getting a picture is probably the best souvenir you can ever take home. So just be mindful, be respectful 
and take care of Mother Earth when you are relaxing. And that's it guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video, it was helpful for you, so please don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell button down below to get all the notifications, like, comment and share this video with someone who's planning a trip to Italy anytime soon. Thank you so much for being here, please enjoy your day!